It's Tokyo Banner 23 coming back at you with another daily video. Every single day dropping those sneaker videos, sneaker reviews from Tokyo, Japan. If you like your sneaker reviews every day, this is the channel for you. If you like your sneaker reviews short, under 10 minutes, sometimes five minutes, this is the place for you. Daily short sneaker reviews. Hit that subscribe button if that's what you're after. Today we're reviewing the Nike Jordan 33 University Red. As I said in the introduction, today we're reviewing the Nike Jordan 33 University Red and 33s are kind of sitting right now. They are not selling fast and getting off the shelves very fast, but maybe, just maybe, this colorway is going to be the one to break that pattern and give the 33s the W that they're looking for. If you're a regular at the channel, thank you for checking in and you will know that I ask for one thing in every video and this particular video, the thing that I'm going to be asking for is a hit the like button. この video の一つのお願いは、いいねをクリックしてもらうこと。いいねをクリックするとすごいチャンネルを助かるので、クリックしてください。So looking at this Jordan 33 University Red, many sneakers that have been selling well recently have been very colorful with many different panels on them. If you think of the Prestos or if you think of the review I recently did for the Why Not 0.2s, link up somewhere. Is it there or there? Maybe it's there. There's a link. Hit the link. What you see is you see a colorful sneaker with lots of different panels on it, lots of different sections on it. And what hasn't been going so well for the sneaker brands is those solid colors, even the Adidas triple black lines are not going so well, which used to be hyped, but aren't flying off the shelves the way that they used to be. And in the case of Jordan, pre-Christmas, the Jordan 12s, winterized blacks, didn't sell very well at all. That solid color, single colors, not doing very well. So how is the Nike Jordan 33 University Red gonna fare? I'm not sure, but it kind of looks pretty good. At the moment, the information I have is that this sneaker will release on January the 15th in America, but I don't know its release date in Japan. Nihon no hatsubai suru joho wa mada desu kido, America no hou wa ichi gatsu no jugo nichi desu no de, moshi kaiste Nihon wa ishou kamashire nai no de, sneakers up de, ichi ban atarishi joho ga sugu deru to moimasu no de, sneakers up wo mai nichi mita hou ga ii kamashire nai. Okay, let's have a look at this Nike Air Jordan 33 University Red and the first Thing that jumps out to me is the lacing system. It's an interesting lacing system, the kind of thing that might be considered revolutionary or innovative or might be considered gimmicky. To me, the lacing system with its straps across the top and its wiring throughout, to me it looks like a snowboarding boot. I like to get to the snow myself and I have a pair of snowboarding boots with the wire lacing system rather than the actual laces and this is what they look like. They look very, very similar. Looking closer at that lacing system, the strap part of it is embroidered with a little message from Nike about the construction of the shoe using Roman numerals for the 33 and that little branding on the strap there is actually mirrored on the inside of the tongue where there's also the Roman numerals for the branding of this Jordan 33 sneaker. And staying with that tongue one of the innovations of this university red is the embossed patterning on the tongue. You can see it here. The tongue has that red sort of diamond embossed patterning, which is also reflected if you take a look at the back of the sneaker on the heel and the heel counter it has the same style of embossed patterning in that diamond formation. And then again, the same patterning of leather is on the mid foot mid sole where the mud guard is. So you've got three places with the diamond embossed patterning. So we had the strap with the embroidered writing on it and the inside of the tongue with the embroidered writing is kind of a pair. You've got that heel cup, you've got that tongue, you've got that mud guard embossed leather patterning on it there. So that's kind of a set of three. And another set that comes in is that heel and the tongue where the branding is in a metallic red, which is quite a fiery design and really pops. In the case of the heel, it's it's the Nike logo and the Nike branding, and in the case of the tongue, it's the Jumpman logo, which is in that metallic red style. And the final touch, again in red, is if you flip these bad boys upside down and have a look at the sole, it's a translucent red sole, and I think it's absolutely fire, and it totally matches the sneaker. You will have seen me comment about how I think a sole can ruin or make a sneaker in the past, and in the case of these Jordan 33 University Reds, I think the outsole absolutely matches the sneaker and that translucent red effect is a fantastic, fantastic design element. So taking a step back and looking at the whole sneaker, very red across 
the board, but with black accenting in it and that red metallic branding as well, I think it's enough to set the sneaker apart and say yes to the design element. It's not like those winterized blacks I told you about earlier where I think there was too much black on them. I always moan about those Mocha 3s with too much white on them. In the case of these Jordan 33 University Reds, yes, I think there's the right amount of coloring, the right amount of red and the right amount of black. And I have a sneaking suspicion these guys might actually sell pretty fast. And in the Jordan 33, that's unusual these days. So keep an eye out for this one dropping and selling out pretty fast. And there you have it. That's my review of the Jordan 33s. Hopefully it comes in at around about five minutes. I'm trying to get that daily content out there at five minutes. Today I requested a click on that like button. So if you can hit that like button down below. And that's it for today. Thanks for checking in for this review. I will see you tomorrow for another short, sharp daily review from Tokyo Butter 23. Checking out from Tokyo. Thank you for checking in today, guys. I really appreciate appreciate your being here and viewing my content. Over here we have the channel subscribe button. Channel toro kuzihi onagaishimasu. Over here we have the video I recommend you watch next. Kochira wa osusumi desu. And up here we have a link to the channel introduction video. Kochira wa channel no profile no video desu. Check them out. Clicking on them really helps the channel.